Well, Donald Trump's former attorney is set to be back on the stand today. This comes after he testified that the former president was intimately involved with a plan to quash stories that threatened to hurt his 2016 White House campaign. Jared Hill reports from the courthouse in Lower Manhattan. Donald Trump denounced his criminal case after Monday's testimony from the prosecution's star witness, former Trump attorney and fixer Michael Cohen. So it's all, it's, it's really a very sad day for the country. Inside the courtroom, Cohen testified about his involvement in hush money payments that are central to the case against the former president. Cohen told jurors he kept Trump informed of talks surrounding payments made before the 2016 election to adult film actress Stormy Daniels and former Playboy playmate Karen McDougal, who both said they had sexual encounters with Trump. Cohen testified that Trump personally approved of the plan to pay Cohen in installments designed to look like pay for legal services. Cohen so far has been effective for the prosecution. He is the first witness who's really placed Donald Trump directly in these discussions about the payoff to Stormy Daniels. The former president maintains his innocence in this case where he's charged with 34 counts of falsifying business records with the intention of influencing the 2016 election. There's no fraud here. There's no crime here. Cohen also testified that when Daniel started shopping her story, Trump told him, quote, just take care of it. Cohen added that then candidate Trump was furious. The election was just weeks away. And according to Cohen's testimony, Trump said it was a, quote, total disaster. Women are going to hate me. Jared Hill, CBS News, New York.